from here up scalp scalp period that's scalp <laughs> to my channel today's video is gonna be a new hair transformation video okay i'm so excited a girl got a new wig which means it's gonna be a new look like y'all y'all love these videos you guys are really starting to love these videos and i already told you these are my favorite because i love to transform for you like especially on camera like just see me go from real regular real sh regular schmegular degular girl to like the baddest bitch I have a beautiful wig from West Kiss Hair. Look at the, the box is busting at the seam because there's so much stuff in here. They are sponsoring today's video, so shout out to West Kiss Hair for sponsoring your girl's video, okay? They sent me a beautiful wig, and I'm just, I'm ready. HD lace, inches, it's gonna be jet black. It's gonna be real cute. Um, if you guys are excited for today's video, then obviously, Make sure you keep watching. Let me know down below in the comment section. Okay, what's your favorite part? Okay, we're in. Let me just get to the video because I'm doing a lot of chatting. <laughs> a lot of talking, but yeah, make sure you keep watching. Um, click the subscribe button, all that fun stuff. Give this video a thumbs up down below. It helps me out a lot. I love you guys. And yeah, let's just get to it. Okay, so let's go over the little specs of this wig. This is an HD lace frontal, 24 inches, cap size medium, hair density is 250, cause they know I like it deep. They know I like it deep. <laughs> um, but look at this wig, oh my gosh, she's real cute. The body on it already, like straight out the package, so freaking nice. Look at this hair, look at this hair, can you? Can you focus on the hair? There we go. Ooh, look at the shine. This hair is so pretty. It's really soft. There's no like crazy smell. It kind of just smells like, it kind of smells like bleach, <laughs> low key, but I, it's not bleach. But maybe it was like in, you know, it was in the factory with the other bleach stuff. She's very full. This is, oh, this is a lot of hair. This is a lot of hair. Oh, okay, let me take out the foam on the inside so you guys can see the inside construction of it. This is what the inside of the wig looks like. It's an HD lace frontal, um, 13 by 6, so it goes back 6 inches and it's 13 across. You have two combs right at the front of the frontal and then you have one at the bottom, the back, along the nape of the neck, and then you have adjustable straps. You have adjustable straps as well that you can you know, make smaller or loosen if you need to. And then there's tracks obviously all along the, the back part of the wig. This is gonna be really cute. So my plan is to watercolor this hair jet black. I have the, um, the dye already and I have my water boiled um, because I just wanted to cut down some time. Ooh, and they even have some baby hairs already like thinned out towards the front. They just need to be cut because they're hella long, but I like that. This is the first impression because I've never actually worn West Kiss hair before, so we gonna see. We gonna see. This looks like a very nicely constructed wig though. Like the stitching is very neat. I have this Adore Jet Black dye. Um, 121 is the color, Jet Black. I'm gonna add this to my watercolor. Watercolor. I'm gonna add this to my bucket of hot water and then I'm gonna dip the hair in it and then I'm gonna bleach the knots. I'm gonna very quickly go through that because I feel like it's gonna make the video hella long if I'm very detailed with that part, but you guys know how to watercolor and you know how to bleach knots. It's not that hard. <laughs> okay, so I have the wig inside out on the wig head because I'm about to put the bleach on the knots um, on the lace, but she's drying. I think I'm gonna let her air dry. I got my bleach mister. <laughs> this isn't an old, candle this works fine um you want your consistency of your bleach mixture to be like peanut butter you want it to like if you were to hold your brush upside down like it wouldn't fall off because that's how thick it is that way when you put it on the knots it doesn't penetrate the lace and go to the other side and bleach the hair
Okay, so this is what the wig is looking like. I got a little bit of the bleach up on the sides of the hairs right here but i'm thinking i'm gonna pluck so i might end up plucking those hairs out or like you won't really be able to tell but i am about to customize this frontal so Okay, so I put the wig on just so I could see what it looks like. Yeah, it's looking real cute. Like, the hairline, yeah, the hairline looks really good. I'm about to glue it down, but I just wanted to see where it fell, where it, like, where it lands when it's on my head. So I did a little, I took an eyebrow pencil and I just like made very light lines so I know where to cut the ball cap up until this is completely dry and now i'm about to just cut it and i'm just I'm, i want to cut as close as possible along this right here i'm trying to get it my forehead <laughs> my forehead looks so big <laughs> Damn, damn. Yo, I have such a problem with my sideburn. Like they always, always, always stick out of my ball cap and it's cause they grow pretty far onto my face. And then I'm gonna move the comb, not the comb, the adjustable strap. I'm gonna move it to the one that I wanna put it on. Now I'm gonna tint the lace. I already bleached my knots. I never showed you guys the bleach knots, but that's what they look like. They're like a light caramel color, which is perfect. I'm gonna go in with my bold hold um, lace tint in caramel. Okay, dry. Now I'm just about to slide this wig on. Yo, I part, I did, I tweezed this part so straight. I'm so proud of myself. Like, there's so much hair on this wig. Ooh. 
For the glue that I'm using, I'm using the Bold Hold Active Glue, the pink bottle. Um, you can do up to seven layers. Last time I did four layers and my wig stayed laid for like five or six days. So this time I'm gonna go in with, I think I'm gonna do the same amount cause I'm gonna end up changing my hair again. <laughs> you have to make sure you let each individual layer dry completely clear before you go in with the next layer. When I'm applying the first layer, I'm making sure that I'm like pressing down and I'm pushing forward cause I want the ball cap to be flush to my skin. Okay, and now I'm about to stick this bad boy on. I'm trying to make sure my part is in the middle. Oh, why did I use the back one? Oh, cool. Okay, okay. Pull this side down. This is definitely giving HD, like, come on now. It's giving scalp, like, if you didn't see the end of it and you was just looking from here up, scalp. Scalp, period, that's scalp. <laughs> what wig? What wig? What's a wig? I don't know her. We don't know her. Not even done laying is giving wet lace. I'm sorry, what? Oh, oh.
guys i just woke up <laughs> so i didn't finish installing this wig until like 2 a.m <laughs> and i did not feel like finishing <laughs> like styling it i didn't feel like styling it and then doing my makeup so you guys get the full look at 2 a.m so i was like i'm gonna go to sleep i'm gonna just do it in the morning so that was the morning which is why i have on different a different shirt but the lace is still laid honey okay oh i gotta change my battery um the hair is laid look at no baby hairs this is no baby hairs no baby hairs and it looks so good i really did that so now we really about to get into it we about to get into some things you feel me i feel like i want to do crimps on this because i have yet to do a crimp tutorial for you guys i've done the hairstyle a bunch of times and every time i do it you guys ask for a tutorial and i haven't done one yet so i'm gonna show you how i crimp my hair um this hair is beautiful it's so full there's so much hair on this way like it's legit the lace is perfect it's hd it's so thin it was so easy to install and it looks so good like oh my god i'm obsessed it's so long like it's so pretty oh i can't um and i'm just like the part <laughs> i really did that so yeah that was and let's just do some things with this hair okay <laughs> Before I start putting heat on my hair, I'm gonna go in with some Bio Silk Silk Therapy. This is the light one. I'm gonna just put this on my hair so that there's some kind of oil. I don't know. I also just like the shine that this gives the hair, and it smells really good. Let's brush it through. There is um, a little shedding when you brush. It's not a, it's not crazy, but you do lose a couple of strands of hair when you do brush. So. Just be mindful of that. You want to make sure the sections that you're grabbing are not too big. So I'd say like an inch wide. You can go like an inch and a half maybe. And I like to grab sections like straight across. Um, it'll make sense when you're actually doing it, but you'll see like with the crimper, you want it to lay flat so that the piece that you're crimping is like stays together. Grab a little section down here. Um, this is my crimper. On the box, it said it was a waiver. I didn't even say crimper, but I knew what I was looking for. You literally want it to look like this. Ooh, she hot. You see the steam coming off? I got this at the beauty supply store in Brooklyn. <laughs> it's called Red. That's the brand, I don't know. I think this was like $25, like hella cheap. So, but I like it. It does what it needs to do, you know? So with this, you can't put, put it on your hair and then drag it down, cause it's not gonna give you the look, well, it's not gonna give me the look that I'm going for. I'm going for a really defined crimp. So you have to actually stamp it all the way down the hair. It's very tedious and it's very time consuming. So I'm only gonna show you one section in slow-mo and then, or not slow-mo, but in regular speed and then I'm gonna speed it up because it's gonna take me <laughs> a minute to do my whole head. But yeah, you wanna put it here. Make sure you're holding it away from your, your neck. Um, I usually hold it there for like 20 seconds and then I move down the piece of hair. You want to cover the last section that you did on this side with the first one when you move down so that it's like it it flows you know does that make sense i feel like i'm not explaining it right but you guys are watching you probably are getting the gist of it but that's how i crimp my hair so i'm gonna speed up me doing the rest of my head because this is a lot of hair and it's gonna take a minute and i'll be back towards the end we're gonna hairspray so that it stays in place but i can already see this is gonna be mad cute like ugh. see and that's what it looks like
I thought I didn't want to do baby hairs because I really like the no baby hair look. But I think I want to do some baby hairs. So I'm going to pull them out where I had them. But I have to cut them too. Just a little. Not like OD, you know? Razor. This is not sharp enough anymore. I should have just used scissors. <laughs> and then I like to take foaming mousse to shape my baby hairs. Take that a little bit on the back of my hand and my little brush. These hairs around my ear to be shorter. And I'm kind of used to my baby hairs looking like that. I don't know if they're too long for you, but I like my baby hairs long. I'm gonna just take one of these so that they can marinate in place. Yeah, so I'm gonna do my makeup and I'll be right back. <laughs> oh my god, who is she? Who bloody is she? <laughs> oh, this is major, 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 major bad bitch alert. <laughs> Bad bitch alert, bad bitch alert. Bad bitch alert, bad bitch alert. What? Huh? What? What? Um, chow. Anyway, so, did my makeups. And this is the completed hair. Let's zoom in on this motherfucking lace because actually, what lace? Well, honestly, what lace? What lace? What lace? Lace where? What's a lace? I don't know her. All I know is scalp. All I know is scalp. Scalp, honey. Look at that. It's really giving HD. It really is. It's the baby hairs for me. This hair is so beautiful. Honestly, like, this is some of the best hair I've ever installed. It's so, so, so nice. Like, it's holding the crimp wave really well. And it's just giving princess vibes. Like, I feel like my name, ooh, this hair is so cute. We need to find a name for her because I'm legit, I'm obsessed. 24 inches, so, so, so cute. Like, hello. Yo, so, so, so cute. If you guys enjoyed this whole install, customize, install, and style video for this hair, then make sure you give it a big thumbs up down below. If you think my hair is laid, just give me a thumbs up. Like, that's it. If, if my hair is laid, hit the thumbs up button. <laughs> Cause you know, you know, that shit is laid. Like, <laughs> okay, period. <laughs> Leave me a comment. I love writing back to you guys. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to click that subscribe button and join the family at 61K. You know, we on the road to 70K. It's real cute up in here. You know, we got new videos weekly. So make sure you hit that subscribe button and turn on your post notifications. I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget, you are smart. You are beautiful and people love you. I love you and I can't wait to see you on my next upload. Bye.